something new from Bell Gloss. It's their 2011 Pinot Noir from the Dairyman Vineyard in the Russian River Valley. Now, you know, of course, we know Bell Gloss. Um, it's Pinot Noir winery owned by the Wagner family of, uh, of Camus fame. And uh, they've got exceptional vineyards where they produce single vineyard Pinots in the Sonoma Coast and in uh, Monterey. Um, this is uh, their first vineyard in the Russian River Valley. And it's a vineyard that they've been working with for a long time and planted. They finally uh, now own this vineyard. And it's in the, the southern alluvial plain of the Russian River. And so um, it's, it's a cool part of the, uh, of the valley. Um, you get a lot of the fog rolling in from the ocean. Um, but it's a vineyard that's uh, you know, shown incredible promise. Real, really good quality fruit over the years. And um, 2011, for fairly cold, cool vintage. So you had um, ended up with much lower yields than usual. And you had much late, later ripening of the fruit, which was good for Pinot Noir, because obviously those low yields give you a more concentrated fruit. And that long, long ripening season lets those flavors develop and lets you retain the good acid balance in the wine. Um, they age it in uh, French oak barrels for nine months. They use a, a portion of new oak, uh, about half roughly. So. But um, wow, beautiful nose. It's really bright. Um, cherries, cranberries, like cola. Nice, nice brown spices, um, notes of cinnamon, brown sugar, even. Hmm. It's really nice, really nice deep aromas. I'm not getting that uh, sort of lighter sort of strawberry note that I get on some of these wines. But let's try it. It's really rich. Um, a lot of those black cherry, plum, and spice notes in there, wow. Really kind of um, rev up on the palate, but really good acidity. I mean, it's, it's kind of mouthwateringly tart. Um, it's it's a, like a big mouthful, but it's like biting into a sort of a, a ripe, tangy uh, plum or something like that. You know, you got that good acidity, but you get all that nice fruit along with it. Um, I don't know. <laughs> Getting also those, those brown sugar notes kind of lingering on the finish. Another real hit from uh, Belle Gloss to add to their, uh, to their portfolio. And it, uh, it has its own distinct character. It's something that's uh, very unique. You should really try it. Enjoy. Enjoy.